Hello, hello, welcome to Q Design. I'm Janine, and in today's tutorial, I show you how to use the hand tracker for your particles and how to make a nice thumbs up particle and how to add these shine or wheel uh, animation to your background and attach it smoothly to your hand, head tracker, face tracker, right? Um, let's start, and I hope you enjoy this process. All right, let's start with a new project. Uh, Hello, and I will resizable a window just in case, so you can see a little bit more um, of this uh, of my of this of the screen. Okay. <laughs> Okay, we start with the segmentation. At first we need two rectangles, but in different uh, canvas. Both of them filled size. And uh, this one I uh, name uh, the canvas is a uh, bag ground or just back and uh, this is the, the the front side front. great now we need for the segmentation the texture extraction and uh, the segmentation person segmentation mask and for the background of course a material matte back matte and um, in texture, camera texture and alpha person segmentation and invert. You see nothing because uh, the front rectangle is uh, over that. So I just make it visible. Yes, yeah, so you can see it right now. Yes, I think it's okay. And I love to shader type flat. For the wheel or the shine we uh, add into that scene later, we need the front rectangle, so the segmentation for the front, for the front, sorry. I want to say the all the time. I know it's not right, but um, well, a new material, front mat, and just to make it a little bit. Well, of course, we don't see it, right? Same with texture camera texture and alpha matte person segmentation mm, I'm not sure but yes perfect and now we start with the face tracker first because we need the face tracker later for the wheel so that the wheel can or the shine can move with the with the head and face tracker we take a face mesh great so the Face tracker is also in here and new material uh, call, this, call it mesh matte physical based or metallic roughness and screen. A little bit, yes, this looks good. 
So I see that the mask disappear. So use uh, right to depth, I think, and use depth test. Switch it off. So yeah, it's perfect. <laughs> And now we start with a wheel and we need a plane for that. It's um, we need the three dimensions um, and new material, uh, call it shine, matte and add a new animation sequence, call it shine and add in this animation sequence or the, the uh, whole PNG sequence. Yeah, okay. I think uh, frames per second are okay. So it's um, a little bit smoother in the animation and it's a little bit too small. So I think seven, seven is okay. Great. And now we put the shine between the front and the back the back so and that's why I need two canvas it's easier for me to uh, put this layer uh, between that because um, I tried with uh, one Canva and the layers and uh, sometimes it works and sometimes not so uh, this is the easiest way to fix that problem Perfect, and now we add into the scene, uh, into the patch, the face tracker and a patch from the patch from the patch library, patch assistant, utilities, and yes, the ex I don't know smoothing vector three because there's uh, for the x y that done okay close it and uh, two we need two of them and uh, we need two uh, patches one for the position and the other for the 3D rotation. And now position and rotation. Now it's smoother. You can manipulate the um, properties in the patch or that is more or that is my uh, lazy easy version you can add a null object to the scene and put the plane into the null object call it shine and move that Ta -da. make the shine a little bit bigger mm, maybe 10 yeah. So the animation is a little bit smoother than just attach the wheel to the face mesh. Now we want to um, add some color to the wheel. 
Maybe I put the wheel a little bit down and farther away or closer. Okay. <laughs> um, okay. Now we add some color to the wheel and it's with an called a mix and add to the mix the color and we use we need the texture from the shine mat and you need and now you can manipulate stop the colors of your wheel yes maybe you want also add Sorry, uh, you can also add um, different shader types. Um, so there's a little more um, interaction with the scene, maybe um, directional light. It's just an option, so you, your scene makes looks a little bit more I was want to say uh, realistic um, to have some fun just with uh, the scene now we have uh, the scene and we um, now we start with the particle and we need at first a hand tracker and uh, this is um, you can't use it right now maybe because you have to um, you can just use it for the Facebook um, story not for the Instagram story so you have to enable that or whatever <laughs> and now you can put the hand tracker into the scene and we need two particles one for the hearts and one for the thumbs, thumbs. Um, heart and thumb right add a material new one of course heart, mat, add texture Great, and of course, the material, um, mat, and new texture. Perfect. Now we manipulate uh, these two birth rate one point five speed a little bit slower angle not here but the life span is six seconds and the scale is zero one yes looks be better and the look a little bit more realis realistic ah. we need uh, to make for the material just a little advanced render options you better mm -mm -mm. 
force zero uh, no point zero so it goes to the left side a little bit looks looks good okay and for the thumb there's something extra we start with zero five and go to 90 degrees yes so the thumb goes up does it work good and now we add these two um, particles to uh, the hand to the hand tracker and now when you put your hand up you see the particles great and now um, we need or we um, add to a mix or the same mix uh, to the particles to the particles add to new mix um, patches and put the icons into the scene heart and thumb and now add uh, heart and thumb texture thumb and heart Now we can okay. manipulate the color of your great more red. Perfect. And that's it. Thank you for watching. If you have some question, please leave a comment down below or send me a DM via Instagram at Kuno Design. And please, uh, of course, you can also leave um, a subscription to this channel. And we see us uh, next week. Enjoy the process.